I, uh, it's that time of the year again where I unbox my hibernating tortoise. So let's get to it. You know the score. Okay, everyone, you know the score. He's in the fridge. Um, he's in the fridge because it keeps him at a stable temperature between about three and five degrees. So that's perfect. It's good to have a fridge thermometer. Um, there he is. So I'll just take him out. See how he's doing. I might have to cut because it's a bit tricky with one hand. But there he is. Right. We'll get him out and warmed up. Okay, here we go. I've made him a little set <laughs> where he's got a little towel and stuff. Uh, so we're just going to take them out and then we're just going to let them warm up for a little bit and um, probably about an hour or so. So it usually takes them like about half an hour, an hour to just open his eyes and then get moving. And then after that we'll give him a bath, uh, just a lukewarm bath, nothing, to, nothing too hot to give him a fright or anything. But yeah, let's get going. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> I made a mess of that. So he's been hibernating for four months, which is long enough. Um, kind of ideal time to give him like a big rest and stuff. And there he is. Looks sleepy. He feels cold as well, but I mean, that's kind of natural. He's been in the fridge for four months. <laughs> I'll just fix the camera. So, I'll probably just keep the camera on him for a wee bit. Um, I'll just let him come up to temperature until it feels like opening his eyes and stuff like that. Okay, so Herman, he's opened his eyes and he's just having a little stretch and stuff like that. Um, so I'll just let him wake up slowly. I'll probably leave him for about, I don't know, half an hour, an hour to kind of get to room temperature and stuff like that. And then we'll give him a bath and warm him up a bit. And that'll be him, just like that. After four months of being asleep. Fascinating. Okay, that's Herman in the bath. Um, water's not too hot, it's just kind of lukewarm. So what that does is it brings them up to temperature. And it also hydrates them, so it gives them like a little drink as well. Because if you remember, he hasn't drank anything in about four months. So hydration is very important. So, that's him pretty much. Thanks so much for watching. <laughs> Welcome back, pal. So that's that. That's Herman up and about again. Um, still fascinates me how after four months of being fast asleep, he just kind of starts kicking about like nothing happened. Um, usually I'd like try and get him some sun at this point. I'd get him in the garden and try and get some natural sunlight and stuff, but it's just, it's horrible just now. We had like a big um, cold snap recently where there was bits of like snow and stuff in March, which yeah, it's Scotland, but still felt a bit weird. Um, so I'll wait a bit. He does have his enclosure where he's got like a heat lamp and a UV lamp for when the sun's not out. So he's got that and then when it's done, does come out I'll um I'll get him outside as soon as I can and um, just some like quick FAQs I know I do this all the time but like maybe someone's seen this video or seen one of my videos for the first time so a lot of people always ask why a fridge and that's because it keeps them at a stable temperature 
if I hibernated him outside, if it if the temperature dropped too low, he might like freeze and die, and then if it got too high, and he might just wake up early. Um, the uh, people always ask if he can breathe in the fridge. Um, yes, he can. Um, when tortoises are t sorry, tortoises are in the wild, they'll bury themselves underground and they'll breathe very, very slowly. So they don't need a lot of oxygen when they're hibernating. So fridge is okay. I do open the door every day or so just to waft some air in. And I always check the temperature. And I'll, I, I take him out and weigh him every week just to make sure he hasn't lost like a dramatic amount of weight. Um, so there's nothing to worry about. And what else did I ask? People always ask, how they know how I know when to wake him up um, I usually time it to four months my vet always said um, four months is like a good amount of rest for them and their little systems um, he doesn't really wake up on his own because he's in the fridge he's at like that stable temperature and um, so he kind of needs me to be like right that's four months let's go well as like if they were in the wild or some people do let them hibernate outside they would just wake up when the temperature um, rose to about 10 degrees or something like that. So I think that's me for today. Um, I love doing these, like, and I want to do more. I know I do one a year and that's kind of cool. And it's cool to see, like, um, how I've changed over the years and stuff. Like, there's one, I think my first big viral one was, like, 2015 and that was like you could tell I was still quite shy and stuff and not very good in camera I'm still not um, but I also had hair which is cool and there was one in like 2017 I think where I was like dead skinny like too skinny uh, which was funny but I put that back on so <laughs> don't need to worry about that but and I love people's comments and stuff when people are like oh I look forward to this every year and oh it's, it's good to see Herman and stuff so that's cool but I will try and do like another one this year um I'll try and make like a summary one um I want to do some work in the garden um especially like with plants and flowers and stuff because there is a lot of flowers that tortoises can eat so um do that and I'll maybe make a video be, to be like right we all know what Herman's like when he wakes up from hibernation but here's what he's like during the summer and um, here's how I keep him and what his behavior is like and stuff like that so but yeah thank you so much for tuning in um, before I forget I don't monetize these videos because I, I don't think you can because I only make like one a year but I do um, I work as an artist believe it or not and I do do a lot of I do a lot of tortoise artwork. Um, I've got a little postcard set in my shop. If anyone wants to check it out, um, it's just a wee set that's five pounds, and I can ship them uh, worldwide. Um, I'll put a little link in the comments. But in the meantime, thanks so much again, and I'll see you soon. Cheers.